This video is going to show you how to set the weighted total and the external grade within the Blackboard Grade Center. Uh, the weighted total column calculates and displays an overall grade for specific columns based on each column's respective worth of the total grade. So if you choose to set up a weighted total column to reflect the overall grade, it's highly recommended to manually calculate several grades to ensure the values being reflected by the column are correct. So to access the grade center, you must first be in your course shell. Uh, and the first step to set up a weighted total column is to expand the grade center in the control menu and the control panel here and select full grade center. Now a weighted total column is created in every course. As you can see, it's automatically in here on this one. To set up the weighted total column, click the double down arrow icon in the column header and choose Edit Column Information from the menu. On the next screen here, scroll down until you see a series of three boxes. Here are my three boxes. In the Columns to Select box up here, highlight the columns you wish to include in the overall grade and click the over arrow to bring them to the Selected Columns window on the right. So I'm going to include these three. And I'm going to put them over. Once the columns are in the selected columns area on the right, uh, you can enter the weight values. Now the total weight value must equal 100% in order to display the accurate values. So I could make this one worth 20, this one worth 20, and this one worth 60. And then you can see here, down here, my total weight is 100%. Now, if you wanted to remove one of these, if you made a mistake or you wanted to remove one, you can use this X icon to remove an item from the list if necessary. Next, you need to choose the way in which the grades are displayed to students. For instance, if a student receives 80% on the first assignment, that is worth 20%, then a running total, yes, this will, calc this will display the, the student grade as... 80%. If you click no for a running total, this will display the student grade as 8%. So very important to keep in mind the two different ways of doing that, uh, depending on how you want to show it to your students is up to you. This option section here will allow you to set the visibility of the column. It is set to show the students by default. Um, however, it can be hidden from the student's view if desired by clicking no. So you click no to show it to students and no to include it in the grade center calculations. In this case, you probably want to stick with the defaults and show the column to the students. Uh, once you're happy that everything equals 100% and that all the options are filled out, you can click Submit. Now to set an external grade, by default the Student My Grades area displays the value that appears in the total column as their current grade. So in this column as their current grade. If you wish to display this uh, change this display to the weighted total column value, you must set the weighted total column as the external grade. So you can click the double down arrow um, right here beside the weighted total column and choose set as external grade from the menu. So the green check mark will remove from the total column, previously it was over here, and now it will be on the weighted total header indicating that this one is now the one that will display as the current grade for the students. If you'd like to completely and totally hide the total column from the students, click the header arrows here and choose Show Hide the Users. This will display a red slash in the header indicating that it's now hidden from the students. Optionally, you will now have the ability to delete the total column from the Grade Center if you want to get rid of it completely. 